Welcome to Brother Frank TV, beautiful people. Today, I'm at the haunted Virgin House in upstate New York. This place is believed to be extremely haunted and extremely active. We're about ready to head inside and check things out. But before we head in, Cue the intro, please. Oh, all right, let's get ready to enter. As you can see, they definitely got 24-hour video surveillance, so if you want to come check this place out, guys, just do it the right way. Set up an appointment. And they're such, so wonderful. See, they got the big screen there, and it's definitely <laughs> protective. And anyways, this house was built in 1858, guys. There goes some of the merch. Nice cool shirt right there. This place is believed to be extremely active and there's even believed to be a portal which we will get into upstairs. The Haunted Bergen House has a long track record of history and ghosts. That's what I'm being told. I'm going to put link in the description. And I'm going to make sure that I can put whatever I can in the description for you. But there's lots that go on in here. There's figures standing outside looking into the house. Disembodied voices. There's growls. Shadows upstairs supposed to be a grumpy man there's children so anyways guys let's go ahead and get on with this tour slash investigation let's make sure i got my meter going we'll definitely set up the rem pot upstairs Alrighty, here goes we got our meter going right there and and they do live on the premises so here go the pictures that have uh, really drawn a lot of attention on the internet if you look up this place here they go. The eyes are said to move. So, here we go, guys. And as always, if you catch anything, please leave me a timestamp. Oh, amazing. The house is bigger than it would appear. It comes off like it's small when you pull up. But I'll tell you what. It's got some decent size to it. And um, big backyard, long driveway. I'm going to definitely plan on coming back here and doing a nighttime investigation. This is the only time I could fit in to come here. But these rooms are all said to be active, some more than the others. So we definitely got the meter going. Guys, we're going to set up the REM pod. This is the hallway. When I came through before, it was like really cool. 
lake and then it got really cold and it said that there's a spirit that monitors this hallway right here and that's the stairs right there that takes you upstairs to where the portal is located and she said you should ask for permission before heading upstairs whoa did you guys hear that i just heard like a growl we go. we're gonna go ahead and set up the rem pod and see if we get any action down here before heading upstairs and investigating that area so let's do that I'm gonna set that up right now all right guys we got the rem pod set up right here as you can see and the only way that this rem pod goes off is if you touch it or something touches it makes it goes off all right we'll leave it there this is supposed to be an active room and i feel the temperature change right away and while i'm in here it's like really cool in here so we'll also want to get our light going because it gets dark and this room here is where i believe the owner when she was younger this is the room where right here used to be beds and this is the room where she was levitated right in this room here guys that's what she told me and i absolutely believe her so we do have the meter going and the rem pod is set up There's also an amazing barn in which someone hung themselves that we will do in our bonus footage, guys. Alrighty, let's keep the light. This is uh, without a light in here. And again, there's the REM pod, so you know where it is. This is where a room where her mother actually sleeps right in here and she said that she has felt the bed shake at night and they've also witnessed imprints in their bed when they can see like when the bed was just made they'll be able to see like a an imprint of somebody that was sitting there right next to you and there's nobody there I just heard that creak right there as always guys if you hear anything make sure you help me out with timestamp Now the room just got very warm, very warm. Brother Frank loves you. See if it might have been too dark. Brother Frank loves you. And we'll now put the light on in this hallway All right, let's grab the REM pod and head upstairs. That's just me touching it. I'll turn it off till we get upstairs. All right, 
let's head upstairs and you can see how it's, it's very dark without the light so let's put the light so we can see where we're going and head upstairs all right we're coming upstairs here we go And here we go. I always like looking down. Now this is the room and the actual table where they have done seances. And I'm going to set the REM pod down. All right, that's just my water bottle. Set the REM pod down right here. So you guys can see, I'm just going to turn it on. There we go. And we'll have the meter right there for now. And let's just take a little walk around. This is uh, possibly the most active room in the house. Now, as you know, that REM pod rarely if ever goes off it did go off and we did i did capture it in the wilson castle so we did capture it take a look out there now way out yonder I don't know if you guys can see the pine trees, but that's believed to be where there was a witch's grounds out there. I'm not sure if I'm able to get there today, but when I come back and do a night time investigation, we're going to go there as well. I'm limited on time. This was squeezed in just so I could come here. And I'm happy we were able to do that. Now let's enter the room. This is the room, guys. It's got the good, good creepy rocking chair. This is the room that's gotten tons and tons and tons of activity. And they've had lots, and I mean lots of paranormal activity. Lots of paranormal investigators that have been here. It's Like I said, it's considered to be one of the most haunted houses. Uh-oh, guys. Something. The, the REM pod is starting, guys. I just heard it starting to go. Here we go. I just started to hear a little bit. And I saw the meter starting to move as well. You see it's starting to flash a little bit. Wow. I want to show you a quick look at the portal. You just feel like a, a heaviness, a tightness in this room. Now this is where it's believed right here where all the spirits come through. And this is believed to be where the portal is, guys, right? there this is it this is the room where they believe that they have a portal to where the spirits come in and they got a good creepy chair and an even better one there so this is the room i'm going to definitely bring the rem pod and we're going to do a necrophonic session in here as well but for now i'm gonna go silent let me know if you catch anything. The REM pod, guys. The REM pod, guys. There it is, guys. You hear it? You heard it go off, guys. 
You heard it go off. This is the room where they did the seance. Wow. Holy smokes. Let's bring the meter in this room with the portal. Let's put the meter right here on the bed. They've also had things that have got flown off the beds, jackets and stuff. People have been scratched in here. Brother Frank loves you. Let's bring the REM pod in here, guys. It may make a noise when I pick it up, but that's just me. We know that this way you know. And let's bring it in here. And let's put it right, right at the entrance way right here. Here we go. Whoa. Look at that. Right at the entranceway. Look at that. That's right at the entranceway of the portal. Wow. Holy smokes. This is where all the activity is. There you go. Can you make that go off again? Can you make it go off? I have the meter right here. Nothing going. The meter is not active, but the REM pod, uh, you heard it. All right, let's see what goes on. Wow, <laughs> that was a little freaky right there. See how dark it is in the portal? Look at that. And you can see I touch it, come near it, and it goes right off. This way you know. That's how it works. Whoa. I just seen this start to go off. There we go. There we go, guys. You see, you see it right there. And it's only me. And whatever spirits are in this room, thank you. Thank you so much. See? I like that. Let's leave that because we could hear that. What I'm going to do is bring the meter and set up the necrophonic where they did the seance. Wow. My ears are standing up on my arm. Good creepy chair. All right, let's get the necrophonic going, guys. And it's the only spirit. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That thing just went all the way over. Can you make the meter go go again? I'll set up the app, see if any activity. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Let's get the app set up. Wow, look at that, guys. Look at that. Thank you. Thank you. Can anyone make that REM pod go off again? Can anyone make that REM pod go off again? That was just my water, guys. Guys, that door just closed on me, guys. Whoa, that door just closed on me, guys. Wow. Holy smokes, it's starting to get real active up here, guys. 
Can someone close that door? Look at that. There's the REM pod. Wow. Let's see. Let's go in here. And keep our eye on the door as well. Alright, the REM pod. Right there. And the door. I want to set up the necrophonic. Wow. Thank you. Thank you so much. You've seen it, guys. The meter's going off. The REM. Look at the door, guys. Look. 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 Look at that, guys. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Wow. I really had to pull that one open. Holy smokes. Wow. I, I told you, they said that the doors close on their own. Wow. This, this, this place is active. The meter. Oh, boy. Let's get a little bit of necrophonic going, guys, and see if anyone wants to talk to us. Here we go. Hello, is anyone with us? Who, clo who closed the door? Thank you. How many are here? Are, are there any children? Are there any children? Wow, meters gone wild. Wow, guys, it's just top-notch activity let me stop that for a second let me tell you something if you guys are any of you like to do paranormal investigations this look at that look at that look at that wow that is powerful I want to make sure we keep our eye on the door as well. Thank you. Thank you for making the REM pod go off. Wow, guys. Come on. I mean, come on. You hear it and you see it. You saw the door. You saw the door close on its own. Look, look at that. Thank you. It's starting to get really active, guys. I want to see if this door does anything. Can you close that door one more time? We're going to get ready pretty soon to go get some bonus footage. I'm on limited time. And I got... Wow. I got about close to a five hour drive to get home so wow <laughs> look at that and we still have to go we still have to go in the barn that's supposed to be very active that's going to be our bonus footage all right that's just me All right, let's get one more good look in here. See how dark that is. All right. That's just me picking it up. Thank you so much. Wow, what a eerie feeling I'm getting in that room. Let's put it up here on the table. Wow. It's 
like I'm feeling tightness in my chest. I'm hearing footsteps. Tell you what, this is the room with lots of activity. Alrighty, let's uh let's shut this off and head downstairs. There we go, this way. Wow. <laughs> That's just amazing. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. May you all rest, and thank you. All right. Let's get ready to go get some bonus footage. Wow, that was amazing in its own right. Wow. time set this REM pod up right here. Okay. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's see if we're able to get any. Wow, there it goes. Alright. And there it is, set up right there. And remember, just to put you in perspective, that's the stairs to the portal. the room where the owner when she was younger was levitated now guys as always please like please comment please subscribe there is a new link for my merch which you guys can go and check some out and also you can catch me on all social media platforms. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. I do give sneak peeks on there as well of upcoming videos. So you'll want to get on there. Wow. Well, we're going to get ready now to head over and... We'll get some bonus footage and give you a nice look around the entire outside of the house so let's go ahead and do that we'll shut this off we'll, we'll we will turn it back on once we go into the barn which someone hung themselves and it's considered to be extremely active so all right, we've just come full circle and we're going to get ready to head back and as you can see this place is look look right out there guys. You see the look at that. You see two black cats there's one looking right in. Check that out. One two amazing Two black cats right by the barn where we're headed. As we're getting ready for bonus footage. That's actually the barn right behind it. And someone hung, hung themselves 
back there. Let's take a look right here of where the barn is, which is right there. That's where we're going to be headed for our bonus footage right there. We'll also do a once around so you can see the entire outside of the house. All right, guys, let's get ready for some bonus footage. Bonus footage, beautiful people. All right, well, I'll tell you what. The haunted virgin house definitely did not disappoint. As you can see, there's the house, which we just went through and did a little bit of investigation. You saw all the activity with the REM pod. I mean, the meter. There was spirit box. Now we're out here, bonus footage. I wanted to take you here on this side real quick. Um, put a little light on. This is where it was believed that a person hung themselves and they actually, they put their initials right there. They believe it's RJ. And those are the initials. And this is right here where he hung himself. I'm sorry you had to go through that, RJ. I am so sorry for you. I pray you're in peace now. So, ooh, check that out. I see a little, a little, little guy hanging out right there. You see him? Check him out. Pretty cool. All right, guys, but let's enter the barn side where there is believed to be lots of activity. I mean, I just thought I heard some heavy growling. I'm not sure what that was. Let me know. Oh, black cat. Amazing. All right, as you can see, there goes the house. Oh, I guess the cats are attracted to that barn as well. Anyways, here's uh, here's the barn, which is believed to be extremely haunted and have extreme activity. All right. Here we are. And there's been lots of paranormal investigators that have come in through here. Check it out. Here goes the table that they like to come and hang out in. There you go. It's got the good skull. You can see it's plenty dark in here. But let's get the REM pod set up. Got a good chair, but we're going to set it right up here. There we go. And let's see. If... All right. REM pod is set up. Let's see if there's any spirits that can make that go off while we're in here. And uh, we've definitely got the meter going. Well, there's a good black cat entering right now. Check it out. Hello, kitty kitty. Alrighty. Good cat walking right with me. All right, let's go check out down here. Wow, that was some kind of it. They say the farther back you go into this barn, the more you'll feel some type of activity. Wow, I see some cats over here. I think. Oh, hello, kitty. Wow, a lot of cats. Hey, kitty, kitty, nobody's going to harm you. At least not me. I love animals. You can see it's it's it is certainly dark even in the daytime. 
Wow, I'm still in amazement. All the activity we got in that room with the portal. Wow. Can anyone make that REM pod go off, guys? We're going to bring that REM pod to the back table. Wow. Totally, I got such a heavy sensation in my chest. That's just me picking it up. And we'll move it back here. There we go, hold it on its side and it stops. There we go. All right, it's back here. Let's see, this is where the lots of the activity is, they say. Can anyone make that go off? I'm also going to show you a full circle around the house. Well, we're not getting anything back here. I mean, sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose some. I say it all the time. Good face right there. All right. All right. I think it's time we uh, get ready to close out the video. We'll go. Take a walk around. Leave the REM pod there. But we'll go walk around and give you a complete look of the house. This looks pretty cool. Looks like you could set up and do some, I don't know, little fire pit action or looks like you could have some fun. But as always, guys, please like, please comment, please subscribe. This is the outside of the haunted virgin house and I definitely take a look up in those windows that's the room with the portal right there to the right guys right there now this gives off like a conjuring house effect kind of like set back on a farm and it gives off like that there's, and by the way it's swamp in there and she told me to make sure I watch where I'm going because there are snakes out here and supposedly they've, they've got poisonous snakes so I definitely got to Keep an eye on that beautiful backyard here. And we're gonna, I gotta come back here and maybe I'll do a, a nice collaboration with some of your favorite YouTubers and we'll come back here and we'll do. Now, they have set up back there. I mean, you take it for what it's worth. I mean, listen, it's always cool to investigate, but they have set up back there where they've seen some really big figure, the figure that has walked back there. And they're now all set up with cameras and trail cameras. So I'm not gonna go back there because they're gonna set up to try and capture. Here goes the back of the house. 
and this definitely gives off a I'll tell you what really gives off like the conjuring house comment below guys if you think this has a kind of a conjuring house effect don't forget to go check me out on all social media platforms guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you want to come here the link will be in the description definitely call up let them know brother Frank TV sent you here she will take good care of you could not they could not be nicer and if you want to investigate well you saw it for yourself I keep my channel as authentic I mean yeah I like to have a little humor in there but as far as when we do the investigating and stuff like that what you hear and what you see is what is actually happening but with that said that's all I got for you because this vlog is over.